Hello world, Techno Sleuth, Craig Chamberlain here. We are moving forward again. We are now on episode 7. Today we're going to bring it all together. We're going to use a piece of software called Advanced System Care. And I'm going to run through something real quick because for some reason this software will not be captured on my screen capturing software. So I'm going to have to do a little nifty trick here so you guys can actually see the screens I'm looking at. First we're going to run through the installation. If you notice on my website, PCMichiana.com, I already have it open. If you scroll down under... Free maintenance software I, do, software, I do have an advanced system care link, which will lead you to download.com and let you download it. I have already downloaded it, so I'm going to go ahead and run the installation here, and uh, we'll get started. So once the installation starts, the one tricky thing about advanced system care is it likes to um, install the Ask toolbar. We're going to go ahead and remove the Ask toolbar right after it installs it. That's the only real trick with IOBit. That's the company that designs this software. So, of course, just click Next. Accept the agreement. Read it, of course, like most of you, I'm sure, actually do. Next already exists because I had it on there before. And I don't like to create quick launch icons. And I don't want IOBit on my favorites. So I'll just click Next. Actually, no, this one isn't the one that ma that installs the uh, Ask toolbar. Uh, just Make sure you disagree to install toolbars. Toolbars just slow down your Internet Explorer. If, if you guys still use that, then click install. Okay, now our setup has come up. So what we're going to do is uh, we're going to configure it. Just click next. And uh, I usually like the black theme. I actually think it looks a little better. So then I'll click start now. Okay, now advanced system care is not going to come up on my screen because of the capturing issue. But basically what will first pop up here is your, uh, you will see this live update that's on my screen. Uh, go ahead and download your updates. I'm not going to download them right now because I, I'm actually trying to make these, show, these videos a little shorter. After you've downloaded the updates, then you're going to open advanced system care. Now what I did is I did a print screen, you know that little button on your keyboard? When you click print screen, screen, it copies the identical screen that you are looking at into your clipboard. And then you can open up something like Microsoft Office or Open Office and then right click and click paste. See, and that's what I did here. So what I'm doing here is I'm showing you guys a print screen of, I, I just went out and printed them all out in advance. Now here's your main advanced system care screen. It automatically runs a scan when you boot it up. I cancel it immediately. And, and make sure that these four boxes are checked. And on, by default, I know that they are. Spyware removal, registry fix, privacy sweep, and junk files clean. But you want to make sure you do your updates first. You know, when you do your updates, then you're going to run through the full scan on these. Spyware removal, here you're on your number four on spyware removal. That's awesome. Registry fix does a fantastic job. Privacy sweep is for cookies and issues like that. And the junk files cleans out a lot of your junk files, much like the crap cleaner software that exists on the market. Now, after you've run through a full scan and cleaned, then you're going to click on Diagnose System, which is right here. And then that's going to open up the Diagnose System, Advanced System Care options. All four of these are going to be checked off. Disable Disk Defragment and Security Analyzer. We're going to use the Disk free Defragment. We're going to use a different piece of software to do that. But go ahead and keep System Optimization and Security Defense checked. Those are absolutely fantastic. Security defense prevents you from uh, getting spyware that's already existent, much like the immunization. And the optimization literally changes settings in your Windows operating system that are running in the background that are causing a lot of slowdown issues in most computers. So that's really nice. Go ahead and run the scan and then do the clean on that. When you're done with that, click the Options button up here up top because Advanced System Care also likes to add itself to your automatic startup. So once you've clicked the options, you're going to go ahead and bring up this screen, which is your general settings. Make sure minimize to system tray when program is closed is dis disabled and execute at Windows startup is disabled. Once again, it drives me crazy when they have this software do this stuff on boot up. Now, the reason I usually suggest people buy this software is because let me bring up the options screen again. There's a actual in your maintain Windows option. You have... Um, uh, let's see here. Uh, I'm looking for the actual drop down. Here we go. System optimization. Right now you're set for basic. When you actually have the full version, it lets you select what type of computer this is, how you use it, top performance, entertainment, daily use, and it'll literally optimize your windows in all the window settings in your operating system based upon your usage. This is actually one of the reasons I suggest people buy this software. I personally haven't bought it. My computer runs fine without it. But I'm just letting you guys know that if you want even more 
speed and performance increase. This, I've been told, is very much worth the purchase price. I haven't used it personally myself, and again, I don't like to buy any software. Uh, that pretty much sums it up for advanced system care, and we brought it all together here. We've uh, cleaned up your startup. We've removed your antivirus and installed the free one, and ran a full scan. We used three different pieces of software to uninstall your to remove all your spyware, trojans, and viruses on your computer. We've ran another piece of software, we've cleaned your registry, and we've also optimized your Windows operating system for actually speeding up your computer. Right now, you should see a huge performance increase in your computer. Be sure to let me know if you haven't, because I'm always you know, wanting feedback. Uh, be sure to leave a comment, leave reviews, subscribe to my channel if you get a chance. Subscribing to my channel is easy. Just go up to, uh, go to the website, uh, if you're at a YouTube video now, you can just click on my channel here, my actual username, and it'll bring you straight to my channel. And let me show you how that's formatted real quick. Basically, what I have is I have it showing the whole Hello World, World series right off the bat. starts with the latest episode. Anybody can watch any episode that they want. And uh, eventually, you're going to be able to go back to the playlist, and I'm going to have more than one series.